Hi everyone, welcome to our new video. Uh, you know, today we're going to show you how to fix this error. Uh, the error is 9909.67. So what you have to do, go to Google and type in this. Type in HP LaserJet, depend on what machine you're using, but as long as an HP and it's the same prom, here in this machine, in this um, uh, tutorial, we're doing HP LaserJet 500 MFP. So, five to five so it's okay it's easy so all machines hp machines you just put in the machine number then you put in farm way then you enter after entering then you're gonna click on that machine they give you then it will give you one two driver software installation or this you can see okay Firmware, I'm going to take the latest one. Okay. After getting the latest one, it's going to download here. Finish downloading. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go and go to downloads and find it there. One of it is still downloading, but there are two. Okay, let me see. Oh, there was supposed to be two. Okay. I get it. Okay, it's fine. I think one was downloaded yet. This one is still to be downloaded. Okay, no, still downloading. Yeah, let's give it time. Okay. And the download is done. Oh, it's going to show us here. It's quite bigger, this one. Let's see. Let's give it time, guys. This guy is taking time, but it's gonna finish. Okay. Well, guys, the download is done. Once the download is done, make sure you put in your USB in here. But also, what you have to do first, you got to um, what they call extract this here. After extraction. You can open this folder. There are going to be two files. You see there's a DDL, BDL. That one is the file which is going to be installed. So you copy this. You go to your USB and paste it here. Okay. After pasting all that in there, the files are, the files are a little bit bigger. That's why it's going to take time. Also, in yes, let's see. Let's give it time. So, yeah, the, the, the file is done. Once the file is done, now you're gonna see what step we're going to do next. But I always uh, like even to copy this on the USB in case I just copy this. Also, the zip one. But you know, the printer is going to select its own file as long as you follow what I've done here. 
um, doesn't matter but all the fast put them in okay well that's it so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna eject my USB trip I took it out so let's go to the printer now step one you get the USB they should be the firmware in here then you put it in here on the printer then you come here you press here down the menu and see administrator you say okay after getting okay then you scroll down you go to download okay then you say USB device okay USB yeah device click there now it's saying no bootable disk say so, okay okay USB thumbnail okay yeah you take that so it selected this then you say okay the firmware should be on so once you you put it on it's gonna download the directly you get me so why because I did extract the files then I put it on I'm gonna show you Remember, we, we're dealing with the HP LaserJet Pro 500MFP uh, 525, yes. That's the machine. You get me? Yeah, that's the machine. When it downloads, after download, when it completes, I'm going to say 100%. Complete, system complete. 99, close, closing record repository it says download complete one is complete then you switch off your machine get me you press and switch it off so then you switch on back okay you know this machine takes a lot of time to on Just be patient, guys. It came back to this error. I don't know what happened. But let's reinstall it again. Admin. We go to its firm. We say download. Okay, I think we should take out the USB after doing that and then 
Let me see. This is the only file we have. I wonder why it didn't work out, but let's see. Let's try it. It should work. Once finished, complete the initial setup process. Thank you for watching our video. If you have enjoyed our content, subscribe for more and visit our website for top of the line editing parts, helpful tips. Something was talking in the background. What I have to do, I have to take off the, the USB. Give it time. Checking the hardware now. Checking data. Now it's trying to initialize. wow guys thank god we made it you say english next setting saved switched off to come back again
yeah guys now you have to to, to complete all the setup the time zones everything like dgmt whatever you want to uh, okay i put south africa here it's 437 no 50 yeah it's 50 something 50 one i think 51 say okay yes it's uh yeah it's four 51 pm finish say successfully saved okay 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 no supply installed trade to and all that there's no papers in here you can see in this tray there's no paper but there is some things you can see our machine machine now is fine so we can make copies you can do whatever you want okay, super fine so yeah guys i think that was one of the best videos we could do for this year it's because it's gonna help a lot of people a lot of people the problem is easier but it looks very problematic okay what i did i put in some papers here uh, and i'm gonna go make so if i say okay it's fine i wanna make i think a copy here let's say start copy okay jam it jammed okay well that's it guys thanks for watching and see you in the next video